it's the gift he had for compression and for linguistic originality. So, um, and, and for using very, very, not just long, orotund, bombastic Churchillian circumlocutions, but then suddenly <laughs> condensing it uh, and focusing on a, on a uh, and using short Anglo-Saxon zingers to get his, <laughs> to get his point home. So he would, he would go, you know, never in the field of human conflict, which is kind of pompous, isn't it? Because that means never in war, really. The field of human conflict is a, a flowery way of saying war, right? Never in the field of human conflict has so much been owed by so many to so few. And at that point, he absolutely has you because he's using these very, very clear English, Anglo-Saxon words we all know. And within those concepts of so much, so many, and so few, is concealed a huge wealth of emotion. So much democracy, free speech, the whole European civilization. So many, everybody who depends on the outcome of the battle, not just in Britain, but in Europe, America, around the world. So few, he's talking about the, the fighter pilot. So he's, he's, he's absolutely brilliant at, and, he, and it's a, it's a, once, you, once you've said it, once some, you, you, you've heard that, mm. never in the field of human consciousness, so much, about so many to so few, it is almost impossible to forget because it is wholly original and yet completely simple. And the same can be said of, um, and what, what that is, by the way, in, 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 in proper rhetorical terms, that is a, uh, a descending tricolon with anaphora <laughs> uh, in, in so, 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 you know, so much, so many, so few, so, so few. Or, 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 so you've got um, uh, instinctive use of ancient rhetorical devices. And you, you see the same thing, uh, for instance, in um, this is not the end. It is not the beginning of the end. It is perhaps the end of the beginning. Now, well, but it is perhaps the end of the beginning. He does say, but, but it is perhaps the end of the beginning. Now, that is an ascending tricolon, isn't it? <laughs> Hang on, yes. before you... Wait, 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 no, this is very important. I think people are interested in this. That, 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 that is an ascending tricolon, but it is varied by what device? By chiasmus. Because he's, he's taken the end and beginning and then flipped them round. And that was also a favourite device of, of, of great ancient uh, orators. And, and actually, one of Churchill's favourite linguistic tricks, you know, he likes to say... Uh, you know, he says, uh, we, we, make our, we make our buildings, uh, we shape our buildings and then they shape us. Or he says, uh, I am ready to meet my maker, whether my maker is ready to meet me, it, it, if, the, if the ordeal of meeting me is another question. Or, uh, he, uh, or, or he says, uh, I have taken more out of alcohol than alcohol <laughs> has taken out of me. Which is, which you know, so he has he has this he has this trick in his mind, uh, and you know it's 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 a it's a trope it's a trick, but he he uses it absolutely absolutely brilliantly, and like all the the best orators, when he when he when he wants really to to punch through into people's imagination, uh, the best English speakers, he he uses short Anglo-Saxon words, short Anglo-Saxon words, and. Politicians who really make their mark, register with the public on the, on the Today programme are those, you know, frankly, who, who keep it very, very simple that time of the morning. And <laughs> what, what, you know, uh, remember, we will fight them on the beaches, right? We will fight them in the hills and in the landing grounds. We will fight them in the streets. We will never surrender, right? Now, which is, there's only, there's only one word in that lot that is of romance or Latin at derivation. Which is it? Surrender. Surrender, exactly. Stanley, you're not allowed to answer all the questions. It's all right. <laughs> I, knew he, I knew he'd know. So, so he, was, he was instinctively 
Brilliant.